you know, I read this. I read this statement from um, technology leaders about uh, maybe uh, uh, more than a month ago, maybe two months ago, about saying that artificial intelligence has the potential to cause the extinction of the human species. No, um, <laughs> yes. uh, technology leaders, you know, and uh, you know, mm-hmm. that, but you'll also hear from others who are saying, "Oh, those people just want a monopoly <laughs> on mm-hmm. uh, artificial uh, intelligence. Yeah. They, that's why they want it regulated, etc." Cetera, et cetera. Um, and they're actually, you know, it's actually much more beneficial uh, than harmful. It's a, but I, mm-hmm. you know, wh- where do you stand on on AI? Because uh, mm-hmm. uh, since you, you know you've you've been you've been thinking about um, uh, you know the ethics of science and technology, mm-hmm. and uh, uh, what what is AI really capable of doing? And uh, is is there a way of of stopping its worst worst effects? Mm-hmm. So, you know, um, for me, I just want to preface this by saying that I don't study AI and its social implications myself, because so I'm not an expert in it. But I've had some experience reading with, you know, as you said, the, some opinions of some technology leaders about how it could potentially end the world. And for me, I'm not really in that camp. Like, I don't believe it can end the world. And in terms of speaking about, you know, what things can end the world, what things should we focus our attention on, the thing that we should really be focusing on is climate change. Because yun talaga, and we, we're facing some very, you know, unprecedented times, you know, the sea, the sea levels are rising, Antarctic ice is melting, and then marami pang migrations and so on. So this is really the thing that we should be thinking about if we really want to think about the end of the world. And if you want to think about the end of the world, you need to prioritize and but i do agree that ai will have some very positive but also some negative effects and so the positive effect some would say is that it can make things very efficient and some mm. uh, as people already know right now from chat gpt I, I know some employers are imp- using the tool to you know make their processes more efficient you know and some students are also making it to, you know, write their essays and so on. And um, it depends na kung where people stand on the use of this tool, but we all agree that it can make things more efficient. But the negative thing that could happen from this is that it disrupts jobs. This is the one of the biggest concerns that I've heard. 